Hey ladies, right, you'll have to excuse me, I'm really not very well. I mean, Alexia, you have been pooler um, since the weekend. Now, um, probably because my brain's half dead, um, I've just done a video and it's gone well over 15 minutes, so I'm going to have to do it again. But obviously it's not going to be the same reaction now. <gasps> what the heck? Right. First of all, before I start, I've got to show you this because I've got Alex you and she's bugging me to show you what she's got from charity shop. <laughs> she's really into altered boxes. So we got this, it's proper wood. And um, it's a games box. It's um, Reader's Digest and it's got, I'll just show you, cards and dice in it. It's never been touched. I don't even think it's ever been opened. But it's proper solid wood. It's a good box, that. So she's going to alter that, 99p. Right, so what I've come on, on for, that I've ruined because I've gone over my minutes. Um, i just finished nearly crying my eyes out at um, Betsy Doodle because she got a lovely, lovely, lovely wrap from, from Teresa Carr. <coughs> and then blow me, i just finished it and I got her at door. Goes to door, postman. Who is it from? Teresa Carr. <laughs> Oh no! So I just seen these, and I'm like, oh my god! I had the wages to do, so I couldn't open it until I'd finished. So I'm texting D, but it's a doodle. I went, I've just finished crying at yours, and now I'm going to be crying. So I am sorry, Teresa, you're not getting my initial reaction because I've already opened it and I've done all the emotional thing already. But I went like nearly twenty minutes. Will it work, Lord? Will it? So I'm having to do it again. So. First of all, she sent me this. Now, she asked me for my address the other day saying she was sending me a plate rack to put my iPad on. So she's lied. So don't ever trust this woman. Because <laughs> she hadn't just sent me a plate rack. She sent me huggings and stuff. So she can't be trusted. <laughs> Thank you, Teresa. I'm really grateful for that. Um, right, so first of all, I've got it all out here now because I've opened it all. She sent me this beautiful, beautiful dangle. Now she were made, she showed these on a video when she made it, when she just made them, and I were admiring them. And I just think they're absolute. I just think she's they're gorgeous. And mine's pink and sparkly. I'm just thrilled with it. Absolutely thrilled. 2014. So that will be in pride of place. I'm gonna. I've got a big wooden mirror in front of me. And I'm going to put a little hook in the mirror and I'm going to hang that on it. Because I like to have the things that people make me, I like to have them around me, on my craft desk. And then every time I look at them, I think, yeah, my mate made me that. <laughs> so that's uh, what I shall be doing. And she sent me a lovely card as well. Here's the daggies on. Little woofies on. Um, saying... Um, she sent me and my daughter some stuff. That's why there's so much stuff because I've got to share it with Madam who sat here skiving off school. <coughs> I've sent you and your daughter some goodies. I hope you both enjoy them. I've also enclosed a dangle. Please feel free to do what you would like with the goodies and the dangle. Well, what do you think I'm going to do with them? I'm keeping them, they're mine. Apart from what I have to share. But no, my dangle will be going right, right there. So... She sent an array of stuff. There's a little bag here with loads of bits and bobs in. Look, little teddy bears and hearts and little pegs and there's some little spools in there. I've seen some little spools and some little acrylic. I'm not showing you. Little acrylic hearts. There's all sorts. Absolutely all sorts. And then she sent me another another bag uh, with some. Ooh. There's a little necklace there. Look how pretty that is. It's just lovely. Wow. And this has got um, wooden stuff in. There's a little a little door there, look. A little tag and a little tie price tag. And hats and keys and pegs and all sorts of stuff. Oh, just drop this. And she sent me some laces. Lovely. Absolutely gorgeous. I can't get enough of lace, me. And then we've got these. I can imagine that getting painted like within the next two minutes. And these, she makes lollipop people out of these. She loves them. 
So she like cuts people out and sticks them on and does puppet shows with them. So she will, and then there's a little, little fan here. I've not opened it in fact. <coughs> have a look. I like these, I think they're so cute. But I can imagine, this is getting robbed off me. I won't even get a look in. Oh, it's to decorate. Well, how clever is that? It's plain. Oh, wow. Look at that, Lex. That's a good idea, isn't it? Oh, her eyes are popping out of her head here. <laughs> <laughs> and she's sent me a little photo frame. And some little oh, butterfly and a flower. We're going to be scrapping over these. We're going to be fighting in the back garden over them because I like butterflies. Look at that. Could have done with that the other day when I were doing Ruth's challenge. I had to use these. Blooming Toy Story Dominoes. So do you know what I might do? I might alter one and um, keep it for myself as a reminder. And then this other bag here. Another bag full of all sorts of little, little doggies and more acrylic hearts. Oh, I've just dropped a little flower out. And just all sorts of stuff in there. Acrylic butterflies. Little wooden bits. Oh, just amazing. And then she sent me another bag, which I've ticked out all over at deck. I'll show you some of them. Look at these. I can actually say I've got bling in my stash now, thanks to Teresa. Got nothing like this. <coughs> Absolutely nothing. I've been trying desperately to make the ones that Fiona Jennings makes. And I just, they just keep falling in bits. It's so frustrating. And I think it's because I've got a wide nozzled gun rather than a precision tip. And I think that's why I can't do them. But look at them. Ooh, they're going to look cracking on some flowers, aren't they? And what else has she sent me? Look at this. Look at this. Look at that. Look at the size of that. Another one. And then I've got these like acrylic flowers. They're lovely those. Love, love, love them. Look at this one. Look at that, it looks like a million dollars and it's a button. <coughs> Where do you get these stuff from? Of course when I look, you know, I never find oh I like these. I'm liking them. Oh, them's them them bead caps. Love, 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 love them. Oh, and another show, like what's on my dangle. I like that too. Oh, I never one of these little, some of these, like little Shambhala, or Shambhala, whatever they call them. Little sparkly balls, disco balls. Look at this one. <coughs> Sorry, I'm barking like a dog, Anne. But look at that. Look at that. <coughs> I just, um, and she sent me some of these, uh, what do you call them, like jewel drops and stuff, where you put little pictures behind them, and I've got little keys, and I've got a little owl, and some of these, look at these, the huge these, I don't know if I can pick them up, oh look at that one, that's got Paris in, quite a few of these, like, oh crap, flat back pearls, but they're massive. They're huge them and look at these, these are just ace. <coughs> Little spools. So I can put a thread on them and put them with me when I do my pin cushions. How cute are them? I, do you know what? I'd like to know where you get these from because um, I looked in Hobbycraft the other day and they had some and they were like £3 for a pack. And I thought, do you know what? They're really cute but I think that's a little bit much for just a few. You know, a few bits of wood, wooden spools. So those, you can't imagine how pleased I was when I saw those. It's like you read my mind. And there's just these little wings. And I love these because I love them for stick pins. So thank you, Teresa. Like I said, um, oh, there's another one here. Another flower. Oh, that's cute. It's a black one. My initial um, emotional reaction has been wasted <laughs> because it went well over my time um, because I was nanging and bawling and getting emotional and um, taking far too long looking at stuff. Oh, of course, I've nearly forgot these as well. Like I said, because it's the second time I've had to do it. 
I've got one of these as well, and this is getting ordered. And I'm so, <coughs> so glad it wasn't sellotaped down. That's getting ordered because it's just beautiful. And look at these. I nearly forgot. Look, I got some napkins. Oh, absolutely. Look at them. They're just beautiful. And this one here, I told my sister-in-law that I'd do a, a wedding guest book. So I think I'm going to use a bit of this on that. So that'll be nice, won't it? Look at that. Colours are beautiful. I can't wait to have a go. I'm going to watch a few videos first though, I think, to make sure that I do it right, you know, because I don't want to mess them up. Look at these with bits of pink in. They are beautiful napkins, those. Look at that one. That little girl with a doll. Just beautiful. And the crown one. And um, Betsy Doodle's got these as well, haven't she? But just look at them. I mean, those images are just gorgeous. I mean, I do print um, images off on my computer <coughs> that I just get off Pinterest and stuff, but these are just absolutely lovely. And I really like that one. Really, really like it. <coughs> I am sorry. Um, so, Teresa, you've no idea how lovely this is, honestly. Um, and I'm just so sorry that my first reaction has been wasted um, because, like a spaz, I just talked too much, didn't I? I went well over my time, so thank you. Um, I'm going to be coming on again in a bit um, because I've got another parcel as well from another friend. Um, I think her YouTube name is Mama Kinder. You may well have seen her um, commenting on videos. She's quite new to YouTube. She doesn't do videos, but she does do crafting. Um, her name's Bernie. And she has sent me a parcel. It's not for me. Although I might pinch a few bits out of it. Um, she sent it me to go in my prize packs. How kind is that of her? And there's loads of vintage stuff in it uh, and whatnot and laces and things. So... Um, I have looked at that parcel already because that's not really for me. That that's to go in the prize packs, and I'm just astounded at what she's sent. Really, I'm and I'm really, really grateful. Um, so yeah, let's see if I've just got time. I got these from. Um, I'm gonna show you these flowers that I got. No, no, these are. Um, I got some flowers from China, and they're really, really nice. And I was gonna show you, but I must have left them upstairs. Um, I got some other bits and bats, some beads and stuff off the internet, and I got some of these as well. I saw that, I'll show them later, Alexia. Um, I'm a bit disappointed because, you, you know, you get your ruler out to try and see how big stuff are, and you can't imagine. But I got these, thinking they'd be a bit bigger. But it's like 50 for like, I think they were a quid 50 or something. So, I mean, they'll, they'll, they'll go nicely on projects, won't they? Um, so, they And then I got some... Um, little satin flowers um, I think I paid like a quid each for them with no postage and then I have ordered some mulberry flowers from um, a lady in Singapore so we'll see what they're like when they come because they are a fraction of the cost of what they are you know you know where in some of the other named places a fraction of cost so we'll see what they're like I'll let you know when they come in about probably six weeks. <laughs> right, thank you. Thank you, Teresa. Thank you. <laughs> I can't believe it. I'm just going to like sit here and just pervert these blings because, like I say, these are the first ones that I've had. So thank you very much. You're an absolute sweetheart. You really, really are. Um, thank you. Love you all very much. And um, I will be on again soon. Bye for now.